the month of March this year we spent the night at Phoenicia Riverside, previously called the Bayfair Hideaway Resort in Betul, Goa. The place took us quite a ride to reach, traveling through Goa's hinterland. But on reaching, we found out that the faraway location came with some uniqueness of its own. The entrance of the resort was quite striking, with the Sal River flowing on the one side of us and a magnificent entranceway that led into the reception area of the resort. My husband was busy checking in while I was busy recording and admiring the quiet and lush surroundings that we found ourselves in. The entire resort is like a lush hideout with loads of foliage, gorgeous sculptures. It felt more like a cozy neighborhood more than a snazzy resort. On the way to our room, we passed through most of the resort as ours luckily was one of the pool facing rooms at the far side of the resort. It comes with a porch, small sit out area out here, a place where you can dry your clothes, right there is a swimming pool area. The pool and the outdoor lounge area was one of the nicest things about this place. I mean just look at how exotic and gorgeous all of this looks. This one thing that I'm really loving about this resort is it has these mellow chill out music playing from these speakers which are all around the swimming pool and lounge area and it's adding so much to the ambience out here that it's like I haven't felt this least stressed out in the recent months from the sit out area by the pool one could view the confluence of the Sal river with the Arabian sea and the shoreline of Betul Beach at the distance, and not to mention the calm backwaters which lay on our side. So overall, the pool area was a total 10 on 10. Evening, we decided to go to Betul Beach, which deceptively is visible from the resort but takes a drive of around 25 minutes from it. It got quite late by the time we reached Betul Beach, but we somehow managed to record whatever we could in the low light conditions at the beach. This stretch is supposed to take us to the beach. We are not very sure we asked the locals, but this looks so dark. We are so late. So we've made it. After walking all the way from where we came in from, we reached what I'd like to call the tip of Betul Beach because now as we take this turn, the beach is behind me as well. So that is where the beach rounds up, literally. These are the waves. You could call them the last of the waves because there is the point where the Sal River merges into the sea.
back at the resort and we thought of taking a walk around it and to check out the rest of the amenities. Just then we stumbled upon a well-lit temple right in the middle of the resort. We offered our prayers and then set out for our room again. So it's time to wind down this video and that's it for this one and I'll see you around soon.